Here we have with us Mr. Dambaru Saikia, the Managing Director of Assam Cooperative Apex Bank. Assam Cooperative Apex Bank Limited, which was established on 7 December 1948, uh, has completed now 74 years and today is an auspicious day for us. Uh, we are entering into 75th year and we are in fact celebrating this day and we will be celebrating this whole year as a Diamond Jubilee year. See, Assam Cooperative Apex Bank Limited is a state cooperative bank and in Assam, the short-term cooperative credit structure, it is two-time. That means Apex Cooperative Bank is at the Apex level and at the grassroots level, they are at Apex, Primary Agricultural Credit Societies. So, bank has been extending credit to the rural farmers for cultivation of crops, various crops and other purposes through its affiliated banks and also directly to the individual members. And uh, we are also uh, offering various other uh, deposit schemes and loan schemes and uh, uh, I believe uh, we are being able to cater to the um, major masses of the rural people and uh, the bank is earning profit handsomely for continuously for uh, last uh, few years and financially presently the bank is doing very good. Yeah, of course, uh, today, in fact, uh, Honorable Chief Minister, Government of Assam, Dr. Hemanda Biswa Sorma, uh, uh, and uh, several of his, uh, you know, uh, cabinet colleagues uh, have inaugurated two mobile banking vans, which we believe will cater to the uh, financial needs, in fact, financial and digital literacy needs of the rural people. And these vans will be uh, moving around the nook and corner of uh, the districts where this vehicle will be assigned to. And uh, common people will be able to withdraw money from these vans. Beyond this, we are already in the process of introducing IMPS facilities, and which we believe will be live within the month of December, within the, this uh, Diamond Jubilee celebration year. Further, we have we are already in the process of uh, you know uh, applying to the Reserve Bank of India for mobile banking license. Hopefully, if uh, we get the mobile banking license, because there are certain criteria which need to be fulfilled by the bank to get the mobile banking license. Though we are fulfilling the you know uh, financial criteria, there are other some issues. Hopefully, we have improved in last two years, and we believe that. Uh, we should get the license from the RBI and once it is uh, we get the license we will be able to offer these mobile banking services also to the customers of the bank. Beyond that we are also in the process of launching two of the schemes one special deposit scheme at least one and one at least again at least one loan schemes uh, to the common public with some special offers during this Diamond Jubilee celebration year. As uh, Honorable CM Sir has already briefed in his, uh, you know, uh, address to the gathering, uh, there are a few criteria to get uh, the bank included in the second schedule of the RBI Act. Now, uh, among others, uh, you know, there are some financial criteria, there are some non-financial criteria, and bank has been trying hard to fulfill the non-financial criteria. Though bank is fulfilling the financial criteria. Non-financial criteria are the one which is actually creating some issues for the bank to get the schedule status. There is NPA is a little bit of concern. We are uh, trying consciously, whole team of the bank under the leadership of uh, you know bank's present chairman, Mr. Bishwajit Fukon, and uh, also the guidance of uh, Chief Minister Sir is also always there. 
we are trying to you know enforce some legal uh, thing to those defaulter borrowers so as to get the npa recovered and to bring down the npas which is the major concern and which is the you know stumbling block block in the process of getting the civil status bank is uh, doing good uh, for in fact there was some slowdown during the covid period and uh, of course i believe that it not only affected the assam cooperative apex bank maybe entire financial market during those uh, you know days of covid after that we have recovered and uh, now last two years we have, we have made again handsome profits last year in fact 2021 22 we have earned near 15.5 crore net profits year before that also we have earned nearly 14 crore profit and uh, our uh, you know uh, total deposit size will be around more than 3400 crores and total loans will be more than 1400 crores cd ratio is more than 42% and uh, we we have a handsome rate of uh, you know return on asset so financially we are doing good as i said and uh, we need some improvement in the human resource uh, part for which uh, today you know we have uh, distributed an appointment letter to 100 new recruits with this we believe it is we believe that the bank will be revitalized we will be able to work uh, with a, uh, you know double effort and we should be able to serve the customers better than uh, ever